Have you seen this? It's a brand new browser and rendering engine built from scratch. This is Ladybird. It's a truly independent new browser and it is being built from the ground up as a full on new rendering engine as well as a new browser. Now, most browsers these days are built with one of a few rendering engines, whether that's Blink, WebKit, or Gecko, and they all power Safari, Chrome, and Firefox, etc. But Ladybird has taken on the challenge of writing a completely new rendering engine from scratch. Now, this is a massive undertaking, and this software is pre-alpha, and it is very, very early. I'm running it on my computer, and you can see not all browser APIs have even been close to being implemented yet, but it does load. It's got tabs, it has debugging tools, and it's relatively uh, interesting to use. There's even, you know, like a show all tabs view. So that makes this thing actually feel like a real browser. Now, it's definitely a long ways off, and they're not planning to go alpha until 2026, but if you'd like to get this running to Day, all you have to do is check out their GitHub, clone the repo, and then follow along with these build instructions. Now this thing does run on Linux, Macs, and actually Windows via WSL2, but only via WSL2. And if you want to get this going, you can follow along with the build instructions. Now there is no downloadable app or anything like that. You are getting into, you know, APT commands or you're uh, running homebrew commands. You are building the application and then opening up the app via the command line. So if you're not comfortable doing that, you're definitely not ready enough to try this thing out because again, it is, it's very early early rough software and not anything you should be using full time as a real browser, but definitely interesting and fun to check out. So let me know what you think of Ladybird. Are you excited? Do you think we need a new rendering engine? What do you think is going to happen to this project long term? Check it out and let me know what you think.